But first, rust armorer Hannah Gutierrez Reed faces up to 18 months in prison after a jury found her guilty of involuntary manslaughter connected to the shooting death of Helena Hutchins. Action 7 News reporter John Carnelli joins us why some feel others should have been criminally charged. Shelly and Doug, Jason Bowles, the attorney for Gutierrez Reed, saying he feels based on the evidence revealed in court, more people could have been held accountable for the death of Hutchins. In total, three people faced criminal charges for the death of Helena Hutchins on the set of the movie Rust. Director Dave Hawes pled to a misdemeanor. On Wednesday, armor Hannah Gutierrez-Reed was found guilty of involuntary manslaughter. And in July, actor and producer Alec Baldwin will go to trial. Do you think other people should have been prosecuted after what was revealed in court? Absolutely, absolutely I do. I mean, if you're going to prosecute people, then you got to prosecute all of them. You got to treat everybody the same. And it, that's a, just a fundamental fairness as a prosecutor. Everybody had some culpability. Attorney Jason Bowles represents Gutierrez Reed. He believes Sarah Zachary should have been charged. Zachary served as prop master on set and was in charge of Gutierrez Reed. During her testimony, it was revealed after the shooting, she took two loaded guns and threw rounds from them away. Those rounds were never recovered or investigated. Wouldn't you think that the police would want to see everything on set? Yes. So when you throw away rounds um, that they may have wanted to see, don't you understand that to be an issue? No, because again, it wasn't the rounds in question. She wasn't investigated criminally, nor was she charged. And is that because she agreed to testify against Hannah Gutierrez Reed? She got an immunity agreement, meaning she will never be prosecuted as long as she testifies against Hannah. So again, you got everybody talking after the, the thing happens, then everybody getting sweetheart deals. Uh, Sarah Zachary got a sweetheart deal. David Hall's got a misdemeanor and they're all testifying against Hannah. But those on the jury say they didn't feel like anyone else was responsible. There was a few mention of other people, but we're like, it's not about them. This is about her, not anyone else. At the end of the day, if Hannah's the only one convicted of a felony, what does that say? I think it says this has been a massive travesty of justice. It does not accord justice to Helena. Um, because I think the biggest thing we can do is get to the truth, get to the full truth and hold people accountable that were that should have been held accountable and then get out to the industry that things have to change, that this is not going to work in New Mexico. Now, I asked Bull specifically what he feels needs to change in the movie industry to avoid another incident like this from happening. His answer was simple. He said safety over speed and profit. I'm John Cardinelli reporting KOAT Action 7 News. Gutierrez Reed will be sentenced April 15th. For all of our coverage on this, go to our website.